Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Mary. I live in Indiana with my husband Nick and our two Boston Terriers, Albert and Edie. Uh, you're probably hearing some ambient noise today. It's so nice in Indiana on this Saturday morning that I had to have all the windows open. So there's a lot of like <laughs> outdoor noises. We've got lots of crickets and cicadas. So welcome to Indiana. <laughs> but in any case, I have lots of pin mail today so if you want to see what i got <laughs> stick around all right let's do these little fellas we got two little guys <laughs> this little tiny. <laughs> oh yeah, okay. There's a good chance you'll hear a lot of sirens too because it's pretty common around here. <laughs> All right, first one. This is actually one that I was looking for for a little while. I kept seeing it on some pictures on Instagram from uh, Collect Random. And every time I'd be like, you don't, you don't really have this one, right? And she was like, no, it's gone. But it just, it, like, it keeps showing up. So I'm just like, maybe she got it back in, but she didn't. So I got it from eBay. So this is the Prince Naveen and Tiana as frogs pin. It actually came from, I think, a mystery pack of um, couples, like mystery couples or whatever. Um, I love it. I love the lily pad with the flower. I adore the little crown icon. That's so cool. Um, they're just so cute, and I like how Tiana is not, like, giving him a stink eye. He's, she's, like, totally into him right now. It's so cute. So I like to imagine maybe this is, like, the proposal or something like that. Um, it matches my gym shore that I have of them in their froggy form, and they're so cute. It's so funny. I have the gym shore that I'm talking about right here. <laughs> I am still so in love with this gym shore. Which, side note, oh, my Bibbidi box should be shipping soon. And I'm so excited, I cannot handle it. I'm so excited. I hope I get another gym shore. Anyway, there we go. Adorable, 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 adorable! <laughs> I love this movie. I love it. So, very, very happy to have this, and it's going to go in my Princess and the Frog collection. Alright, next up, so pretty, this is from Aulani. This Aulani pin, I cannot say enough about it. It's like, it feels heavy, it's weighty, it's so gorgeous. I love the greens, the monstera plants, the palms. Well, I also love the pin on pin, so it's a little bit thicker. Mickey looks so retro. It's so cute. And his lei is made of plumeria flowers, which are my absolute favorite tropical flower. I just really love them. They're so, so pretty. I love the iridescent kind of color of the leaves. Like, it's just so magical. I want to go to Alani so badly. You have no idea. So it says Alani, a Disney resort and spa, Ko'olina, Hawaii. So pretty. I love gold. You guys know I love a gold pin. <laughs> and it says pin trading 2014. I just love this pin. I don't know. There's something about Hawaii. I think because Walt loved it so much, it just feels more retro to me. It's kind of like that feeling I get about Neverland. Neverland. Disneyland. <laughs> because Walt has been there, you know, and he loved it so much. Uh, I think he would just be so proud of the resort that they built and I really appreciate that they made Mickey look so vintage. Like he looks like when old films would play on VHSs, I feel like that's the Mickey face that they like put in the screen. Anyway, I just really love this pin. I love it so much. I, I just wanna see it like all the time. I'm obsessed with this pin. <laughs> oh, I really need to go to Alani guys. Oh, that needs to happen. Let's open these. There's definitely more than one in here, so I'm excited to show these. Oh, I forgot about one that I bought from them. Holy moly. Look at all the stuff they gave me. 
Wow. Oh, no way. What? I did not expect to get these things. That is awesome. They sent me a button. They sent me a button with their logo on it, which is super cool. Guys, thank you. And it has like a little hidden collect random logo in there. Thank you guys for those little extras. That's their card. You can find them on Instagram. That's where I like to shop their pins. They also have an eBay, um, but it's just collect random at collect random on Instagram. They always send you a little sticker and then they also have a TikTok, which is fun. So I have one fantasy pin that I cannot wait to show you guys. So cool. I got sadness and joy from Inside Out. So we have joy, just standard joy. She's got her little yellow dress with the blue starbursts on it. And then sadness looking all pouty. These two characters just go so well together. And they totally, like after seeing that movie, I, I told Nick, I was like, that movie just kind of speaks to how my brain works. Sometimes I feel like certain characters are missing from my brain. Girls, let me know if you know what I'm talking about. Sometimes your brain is just troublesome. I'd love to find Anger. I need to get him, because he's my other favorite. Okay, this pin is super random. It's so random, it's Mickey. Why, what? I don't understand why this is even like a thing. I don't know, why is he wearing a yellow furry coat, a little pea coat with the buttons? If anybody knows what the story is behind this pin, I would love to know. Why is he going to Disneyland with a pea coat? I mean, it is adorable as heck, so I had to buy it. Plus I needed to get over $40 so I could get free shipping, and I was only a little bit away, so I was like, let's just get that Mickey, because I have no idea what he's about. Do you have a, a collection of just like random pins that you're like, it's too cute, I had to buy it, but you have no idea? what the purpose of it is. It's so weird. <laughs> All right, <laughs> moving on. I got a fox from Mary Poppins. How cute is that? I don't know if this is a fantasy pin. It says limited edition of 50, so it must be. But like, did this come with other pins from Mary Poppins? I have no idea. But this looks just like the fox in the fox chase scene. So I had to get him and he was only $10 and he's awesome. I don't have any fox pins from Mary Poppins. And then the last one from this baggie is this amazing NBC pin. I am not the biggest NBC fan, as you guys probably know. <laughs> Maybe you don't. I'm not the biggest NBC fan. I like the beginning and then I hate the part with Lock, Shock and Barrel and Oogie Boogie and I know like watching other people's videos, Oogie Boogie is like one of everybody's like fan favorites. I just don't get it. I think he's mean. I think he's a bully. I don't like him. So I'm not the biggest fan of that part. So I did recently, I realized I had never actually watched the whole thing. So I sat down and I watched it, but I fast forwarded the Oogie Boogie part because I don't like it and then watched the end because I don't think I've ever seen the end. I don't remember it at all. Yeah, I appreciate that Jack came in and saved Santa. That made me happy. Just don't be mean to Santa, guys. It's the lesson here. So anyway, I love this wreath. My favorite thing that is NBC is the overlay at um, Disneyland. And I've never actually ridden it myself, but I've watched tons of videos and I want to go so badly. It just makes me really happy. I love the candy corn and the little gumdrops and the candy in the wreath. Disney sells this wreath as like Christmas decor that you can buy and put on your door and it's amazing. I want it so bad, which is kind of why I bought this because I was like, <laughs> like, I don't know if I would actually buy the wreath but I really, really want to. It's so cool. I hope Brittany is proud of me for getting this. <laughs> I probably am not gonna have like a collection of NBC stuff, but maybe I can have like a Christmas collection and I'll put this guy on there. But it's huge. It is huge. Last but not least, the Tiki pins. I love the design. Like they have this kind of jagged edge design. You can especially see on the Goofy where it's not like super smooth lines around the edges and things. They kind of made it look like it had been cut out of wood, like an actual tiki. It's super cool the way that they did that. I am missing Mickey. I'm gonna have to find Mickey, but that's okay. 
I have everybody else, so that's a great start. Chip and Dale, I think, are probably my favorite, but also Pluto. He has such a cute design. The Tiki's are just super cool, so clever. I think these are so cute. I could not pass them up. I was gonna buy them all individually, and then I found the set of five, so all I'm missing is Mickey. So I'll have to find him sometime and complete. It'll be my first complete set of anything. How exciting is that? Anyway, look at this awesome haul. This is the most pins I've showed you guys in one sitting in a really long time. I'm really excited about this <laughs> this little haul or this big haul. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing my new pins. I love it so much. Opening pins is like, I don't know why. Somebody keeps commenting that it makes them so happy. Opening pins and watching other people open pins and I totally get it. I don't know why it's so enjoyable. They're just like, I don't know. They just make me really happy. Why does this little piece of metal with color on it make me so happy? I don't know, but it does. This is definitely my favorite pin out of this. It's a little bit of a toss up between <laughs> Mickey with the coat on and Alani Mickey, but I think Alani wins. But I do love this Mickey. Comment below if you know why he has a coat. I'm so curious about that. Was it like a set? Is it a Christmas pin? I have no idea. Anyway, <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you'll come back next week for more pins and I will link above the Disney pin opening playlist that I have. I've opened like lots of pins so <laughs> I'll just keep adding to the playlist and you can see my full collection before I started buying more pins so all of that will be linked above for you. That's it guys. Thank you so much for being here. Like, comment, subscribe, share with a friend who loves Disney pins. Let them know they're not alone in their inability to stop buying pins. <laughs> I totally get it. Thank you guys so much and I'll see you in the next one. I hope you have a practically perfect day.